Hi, my name is Angus. I'm the CEO of Harrison AI. So we are a company that aim to apply the powers of deep learning and AI in solving some of medicine's uh, most challenging challenges. So one of the, our most successful projects so far is a project called Ivy, uh, which is a deep learning based project that able to look at sequence of time-lapse videos of an IVF embryo developing over five days. And this model is able to look at that video and decide what is the probability that that given embryo will create a, a successful pregnancy. NVIDIA solution has been critical both in terms of software and hardware with the advance in GPU, especially given Volta technology uh, and a deject station. We're able to run multiple experiments in parallel and, and designing the most optimal um, solution and architectures so that we get the best possible performance in the shortest amount of time. Uh, we're also looking at uh, creating an artificial intelligence software that is able to detect tuberculosis disease through a frontal chest x-ray and we're hoping to um, roll that project out in Vietnam so providing a national-wide screening program to identify high-risk patients uh, to provide uh, specialized treatment for and screening for them at a very low cost. So at Harrison AI, what we aim to do is to harvest the power of AI and deep learning uh, and taking advantage of GPU accelerated computing to essentially providing healthcare at a cheaper cost, faster and of a higher quality, a triad that traditionally never really happened. So my dream for AI is eventually we'll get to a point where uh, some of the difficult decisions that we need to make in healthcare uh, will be largely automated by AI and that free up the doctors uh, to do what doctors are good at, which is empathizing with the patient, catering the treatment uh, to specific patients and their social circumstances, and essentially be able to develop you know, cheap and affordable healthcare to the mass, especially in limited, restricted country like Vietnam, India, and China, and the third world country. Uh, and, and that's why I'm very excited about this, and uh, I can hardly think of anything more um, stimulating to work on.